Very good morning to one and all. I am Rashmi from grade eight. I have chosen the topic, robo uh, robots to rescue in healthcare field. What are robots? Robots are artificial man-made machine uh, that, is used, that is designed to perform human operation and also perform activities that cannot be done by humans. For example, entering unsafe radiation areas, uh, de entering deep areas in uh, oceans or ground, and hazardous mining jobs. There are different types of robots based on its components and uh, its usage. The first one is pre-programmed robot, humanoid robot, autonomous robot, articulated, cobot or collaborative robot. The, the main parts that are usually used in robots are motor drive for movement, sensors for recognizing, arm joints and legs to make it move, and microcontroller for programming. Robots can be remotely controlled by various techniques in a radio frequency controller or RC, Bluetooth controller, and Wi-Fi enabled controls, etc. Uh, this controller transmitter in the joystick and the receiver in the robotics motor drive module. The transmitter sends a certain frequency to the receiver. Uh, the transmitter sends a certain frequency, which is 27 megahertz, and the receiver detects the frequency, closes the circuit, and uh, connects the power supply to the motor for movement. This robot is used to measure. Uh, this robot is used to measure. Uh, me Am I getting here? Yes, we can hear you, Varsini. Okay. This robot is used in medical field where doctors uh, doctors cannot attend patient in uh, directly in person during the pa uh, like during the pandemic and any other similar situations. I introduced my first robot named RoboMeet. This is used to measure. This is used to measure the uh, patient's body temperature, blood pressure, and, uh, and the pulse rate uh, or oxygen level. This stores the data. This stores the data in the respective patient's record and provides medicine based on the doctor's recommendation. It can schedule the me uh, meet. It can schedule the meet for uh, to meet the patient in the different time slots. Let me show you a small demo. I have made this robot using cardboard. It can move uh, forward and backward and left and right directions. Based on the uh, scheduled appointment, uh, scheduled appointment of the patient, but we can command the robot to the respective patient's room. It will check, it will check the patient and store the data and provides medicine based on the doctor recommendation. That, this is how the, it works in the medical field. Here is the patient. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you to Chairman Sir, to Respondent, ma'am, and Principal, ma'am, and class teacher for giving opportunity to choose this topic. 
and build this robot. And I will also thank my dad for giving more support to learn this basic concept of robot and uh, operations of various skills. Thank you. Thank you, Varsni. It was good.